Hello, everybody. Happy Saturday. My name is Ranjani, and I'm from Genius Kids in San Ramon Marketplace, Dublin Doherty, and San Ramon Valley Boulevard. I'll be your host for today's show. Along with me, I have Miss Marufa from Dublin Station, who will be co-hosting the show with me today. Hi, Miss Marufa. Good morning, Miss Ranjani. I want to thank Ms. Ira and Radio Zindagi for giving Genius Kids this great opportunity every Saturday to host our show. Thank you so much, Ms. Ira. As you probably know, Genius Kids is an award-winning program focusing on public speaking and confidence building with centers all over the Bay Area. The show is a platform for kids all over the world to participate and present their amazing public speaking skills with us. We are really excited to have the show today with our little munchkins, preschool, pre-K and kindergarten, who will be speaking one of my favorite topics today. That's going to be who is your favorite teacher and why? And if you have a picture, make sure to share it with us and we'll be so happy to see that as well. And if you want your children to participate in this show, please feel free to email us at info at geniuskidsonline.com or renud at gmail.com. So remember kids, the house rules, make sure to introduce yourself, tell us the topic and your age before starting and speak in a loud and clear voice, okay? So without further ado, let's go to our first participant of the day. That's going to be Mia. Hi, Mia. Hi. Can you share your topic with us? Can you introduce yourself and start talking? Going to talk about my favorite teacher. Okay. How old are you, Nia? Five. You're five years old. And which grade are you in? Preschool. You're in preschool. Wow. Okay. And who is your favorite teacher? <laughs> you want to say who is your favorite teacher? And what do you like about her? Is she at your school? Yeah. Okay. And what does she teach you? She like reads books and say and like projects and stuff. Okay, so she reads books and says projects and stuff. What kind of books? Like any of them. Sorry, can you be a little louder for me? Like any of them. Okay, and why is she your favorite teacher? Because she reads books and stuff. Because she reads books. So you like reading books? Yeah? And do you remember the name of this teacher? Okay, thank you. Thanks for sharing that with us. And what's your favorite book, Mia? Since you love reading books. Do you have a favorite book? What's your favorite book? Peppa Pig. Peppa Pig. I think that's a favorite book for a lot of preschoolers, right, Miss Marufa? Of course, I love Peppa Pig. <laughs> that's <laughs> Okay, and do you have anything more to say about your favorite teacher? I have a question for Nia. Yes, go ahead, Ms. Marufa. So Nia, are you sad because, you know, this year school is almost ending and then you're gonna have a new teacher next year? Are you gonna miss your teacher? Um, yeah. Yeah? Uh -huh. Are you writing a little letter to her, a poem to her? On your last day, are you planning? Yeah. Yay. That's nice. Thank you yeah. so Thank much. You. Thanks Very for nice sharing. presentation. Good job. And let's move on to our next participant. That's going to be Rishan. Rishan, are you ready? I want to do this. Okay, yeah, I do. Okay. <laughs> Introduce yourself, tell me your age, and then start talking, okay? Hello, from the five years old. Today I'm going to present my monkey called Who's My Favorite Teacher? My favorite teacher is Miss Evelyn. 
Miss Allen, my favorite teacher, because she helps me with my projects and then with recording and with my homework. It used to be in my class. And What does that Miss Evelyn do? Hearing. Hopeful. Thank you for the <laughs> presentation. That's really nice. Thank you so much, Rishan. I'm glad to know that Miss Evelyn is your favorite teacher and she is very caring and helpful too. So uh, what does she teach you? Miss Evelyn, apart from homework, does she uh, read books? Yeah. Books to you? And she plays with you? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. And are you going to miss her too since the school is ending? Yeah. What you going yeah. to Me yeah. and me are going to the same school. Are you going to the same school? <laughs> That's nice. And what is your summer plan? Are you planning on doing something fun this summer? Going to Hawaii. <gasps> wow! You're going to Hawaii. That's so nice. That's very nice. Do you know how to swim yet? Yeah. You do? That's and for nice. one week. For one week. Wow! I want to take a vacation to Hawaii. That's fun, Rishan. Thank you so much for joining us today. Our next participant is Lucy. You have something more to say, Rishan? No. Thank you. Very good job, Rishan. You have a question, uh, Ms. Uh, Rishan, Ms. Marufa? Yeah, I was going to ask the same question, Rishan. Are you sad that school is almost ending and you're not going to be with Miss Evelyn anymore? Yeah. Oh, so are you planning to like write her a letter or a poem or maybe a thank you note? Yeah. 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 This is so wonderful. Like, you know how kids get attached to their teacher? Yeah. yeah. So Do you nice. have a favorite teacher, Ms. Marufa, from oh, your school time? <laughs> I have so many, but I, I mean, I went to school for a long, long time, right? We did, right, Ms. Tanjani? Yeah, sure, we all too. have our, like, favorite teachers there. Yeah, I think Thanks. teachers make a very good impression on kids, right, from a young age, and we all have our inspirations. So I still I remember my kindergarten teacher, so we all have inspirations from, you know, way back. And that's a very nice thing, so. Maybe after we are done with our participants, maybe we want to know more about your favorite teacher, Mr. Anjali, yeah. that's great. Yeah, that would be fun. Sure. Okay. So our next participant, it's going to be Keisha. Hi, Keisha. Hi, Keisha. Keisha, can you unmute yourself, sweetie, and start talking? Hi, Kesha. Good morning. I can't hear you, sweetie. Can you say it again? Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm um, good. Okay. So, Kesha, how old are you? I'm um, four three quarters. Oh three my quarters. gosh, <laughs> four three quarters. So, and um, which grade you're in? Um, preschool. You're in preschool. Okay, so do you want to tell us about your favorite teacher today? Um, yeah. All right, Keisha, go ahead. Um, my favorite teacher, hello friends, my name is Keisha. I'm four three quarters. Today I'm doing my presentation. I'm going to talk about teachers. Sure. What, what's the name of your teacher, your favorite teacher? Miss Wanta. Oh, okay. And why do you like her so much? Um, because she lets us work. She let you work. And she makes us um, art. Oh, you, oh, you do art. art. You know, that's Miss Ranjini's favorite uh, work, right, Miss Ranjini? Yeah, totally. <laughs> 
And what else do you do in your class with your favorite teacher? Um, play toys. Oh, play toys. Okay. And do you read books? Um, yeah. Yeah? I already have a book next to me. Oh, I think you like to read, huh? Yeah. Okay. Um, so what else do you like about your favorite teacher, Keisha? Um, singing songs. Oh, nice. Maybe, maybe after we're done with all the friends, you can sing a song for us today. Would you like to? And twinkle, twinkle is a lot longer than that. And I remember you one of the show. He's a great singer, Miss Ranjini. Oh, that's nice. Yes, that's I remember Keshav. Yep. Keshav, do you have anything else to talk about your favorite teacher? No. All right. Great job, sweetheart. Thank you so much, Keshav. Okay, so uh, before we jump into the next participant, Ms. Ranjani, I just wanted to welcome all the viewers who are just joining in. Hello, everyone. Good morning. This is Ms. Marufa and Ms. Ranjani and all our great participants from uh, going live on Radio Zindagi 1170 AM. Um, we go live every Saturday from 11 to 1130 AM uh, Pacific time. And this platform is for any children between two to five years old and you know elementary age. And um, this platform is for um, their you know where they come and they show their talent. It could be a public speaking, it could be a song. We pick topic every week, and they get to participate. Um, and you don't have to be enrolled with Genius Kids. I mean, you can be anywhere in this in the world, and you can just go live with us. Um, so please do contact us at Renu D at gmail.com if you have any questions about any of our programs. Um, and I just wanted to welcome everybody to our show. Thank you for watching us. Thank you. Um, without further delay, I would like to move to our next two participants together. And they are Arush and Riyanj. Hi, guys. Hi, Arush and Riyanj. Who, who's Arush? Raise your hand. Who's Arush? OK, so Riyanj. Can you come to the front, sweetie? We can see you. Yeah, Riyanj, can you come next to Arush? Arush, we cannot hear you. So can you say, hi, my name is Arush? We can't hear you, sweetie. Okay, so parents, maybe you wanna check their mic. Uh, we are not able to hear him. So in the meantime, so since when they are fixing their mic, how about we go for a riddle, Ms. Marufa? That would be amazing. Okay, kids, listen up. I'm gonna ask you a riddle and whoever knows the answer, you have to raise your hand, okay? And then I'm gonna pick. What animal cheats at games? Who knows the answer? <gasps> Rayanj knows the answer, but Rayanj, is your mic working? Arush, yes. We can't hear I you still first. cannot hear you, sweetie. Okay, Keshav, do you know the answer since you raised your hand? Who wants to guess what animals cheats at games? How about Nia? Nia, take a guess. Just take a guess. Yes. It's a wild animal and you can see them in the zoo. Do you want to guess, Nia? Yeah. What is What's that? Cheetah. Yeah, you are right, it's the cheetah. That's good. Okay, I have one more riddle. How do bees get to the school? Hmm. How do bees? <gasps> she got it, that's so nice. It's a school buzz. You know, it's kind of a wordplay. That's cool, good job guessing. And Arush and Rayant, are you guys ready? Fly. Uh, they fly. Yeah, they can also fly. That's true. That's a smart one. Yeah, that's a good one, too. I think Arush okay. Rianch is trying to get back, Ms. Ranjini. All right. So in the meantime, uh, maybe Keshav, do you want to sing a song for us? You want to do the Twinkle Twinkle for all the friends? Yeah. Yay, let's do it. 
Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Up about the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. When the blazing sun is gone, when he nothing shines upon. Amazing. Can you show your tiny light? Twinkle, twinkle, all the night. Then the traveler in the dark thanks you for your tiny spark. He could not see which way to go if you did not twinkle so. Is that it? Amazing job. Great. I don't know yeah. half of that poem, Miss Marufa. Honestly, I just knew the first four lines. Thank you so much, Kesha. I was thinking the same thing. I think most of us, we just know the first four lines. Yeah, that's very nice. Thank you so much for sharing. Nia, do you know a poem? Yeah, you want to sing one for us? Um, yeah. Yeah, go ahead. Loud and clear. We all love us go round and round, round and round, round and round. We all love us go round and round, all till the town. Who knows the, the next line? The wiper. Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. The the wiper in the bus go swish 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 the bus go swish 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 all to the town. Very nice. You wanna Thank you so much for sharing. Okay, Arush and Rayanch, are you guys okay with your mic now? We still we cannot, still cannot hear, you. hear you. Okay, so mom and dad, if you can help us with Arush and Rayanch. We're not able to hear them. So in the meantime, maybe Rishan, do you want to sing a song or say a poem? Which one, sweetie? Are you sleepy? Okay. okay. You want to sing a song? Are you sleepy? Are you sleepy? Brother John, brother John, morning bells are ringing, morning bells are ringing, ding dong ding. Ding, dang, dong. That's yeah. nice. Thank you. Very nice job. Very nice job. Um, hi, Arush and Riyanj. Yeah, we're not able to hear them. Maybe you guys can disconnect and try connecting back quickly, and if that helps. Okay, okay. so in the meantime, let's see. Hmm. I'm going to ask all the kids a question, and you guys have to answer me, okay? I'm going to start with Nia. Nia, what's your favorite animal and why? Bunny. Bunny, why? Because they're cute. Oh, they're cute. Do you have a pet at home? No. No. Do you want a pet at home? Yeah, she's looking, looking at, at mom. mommy. She probably wants it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, you have to take care of the pet if mommy gets you a pet, okay? And it's mommy's decision. <laughs> All right. Okay, let's move on to Keshav. Keshav, what is your favorite animal and why? Um, mouse. A mouse. Mouse. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Why? Um, because it's tiny and it goes so fast. <laughs> it's tiny How are you gonna and run away. How are you going to catch it? What if it's run away? <laughs> um, with my sport shoes. Oh, he's going to have his sport shoes. <laughs> He's going to run behind it, looks like. Okay. Rishan, how about you? What's your favorite animal? My favorite animal is giraffe. Oh, giraffe. Why? Because it's vegetarian, like me. It's vegetarian. It's vegetarian like him. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. It has a tall neck. And so has a long neck. Okay. How come I don't hear any dogs or cats? They all have their favorite animal, but you know, it's all mouth, a bunny, and a giraffe. That's very interesting. <laughs> right. Thank you so much for sharing those. I, I have a, I have a question, Mr. Sure, go ahead. Rishan, I have a question for you. 
So if you get a pet like at home, how are you gonna keep the giraffe at home? What, how are you gonna, <laughs> what are you gonna do? You don't have things in the backyard. Yeah, you know, <laughs> smart, that's what I was thinking. <laughs> exactly. And we have plants in our backyard. Oh, they can eat, because they're yeah. vegetarian, so they can eat. We have orange plants, oh. pomegranate plants, big plants. Nice. Um, very nice. Very smart. All these kids are so smart, Miss Ryan. I know. I know. Kids, do you have any riddles or jokes for us? Does anybody have a joke or riddle to share? Oh, yeah. How can a giraffe get on the roof? What is How it? can a giraffe get on the roof? Oh. How can a giraffe get on a roof? Yeah. Hmm. Oh, my God. With his long, with his long neck. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, who else has a riddle for Miss Ranjini and Miss Marupa? Or a joke? Nia, do you have something? Yeah, what is it? Joke. You yeah. have a joke? Yeah, do share. Um, you can share. Uh, um... You forgot? She's funny. She's laughing. Just yeah. thinking about it. Okay, let me ask you guys a question. How does the ocean say hi to everybody? With a fish. Mm -hmm. With the with 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 water. Waves. Yeah, it waves. Oh, that's it a cool waves. I mean cool yeah. riddle. Keshav, do you have a riddle or a joke for us? I have a joke. Okay. Um, how can a goat fly? Ooh. How can a goat fly? Not with your oh, sword. Wings. Wings. Goat doesn't have. On wings. a bird. Well, bird. Um, with with one with a helicopter. With a helicopter, yeah. If you take a goat on a or helicopter. Or a plane. <laughs> it's a smart answer. Not a smart cookie. But Kesha, what would be the answer? Um, a roller coaster. Oh, a roller coaster. That would be fun. A goat on the roller coaster. <laughs> That's funny. Why? How can how can a giraffe fly? With a neck. With a roller. How can a giraffe go to space? Okay, Miss Ranjini, I think I'm really at the end of the show. Okay, all right. Thank you so much, guys, with your jokes and riddles joining us today on this Saturday morning. And we hope to see you back in the fall. Uh, Genius Kids is enrolling for our summer camp programs all over the Bay Area. So feel free to reach out to us for all your needs. Thank you so much, Miss Marufa, for co-hosting the show with me today. And happy Saturday, everybody. Thank you, everyone. Have a nice weekend. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye. Bye.